Welcome back everybody to another episode of Game of Thrones. We have made it to season 5. We are starting season 5 today. I've had a bit of time off. I feel like you guys deserve season 5 at this point because I was going to bring it to you earlier but I've had a bit of um, severe back pain and I know it sounds a bit of a, a lousy excuse but trust me on this. It fucking hurt. <laughs> I'd be sat here making some really weird noises that you don't want to hear all the way through the reaction, so I left it. Because of that, I haven't done a review on season four or the final episode properly. Not sure if I'm going to do it. I had other people asking me to do the season five trailer, which I'm not going to do. End of. Others were commenting saying, don't watch it. There's lots of spoilers. Others were saying, please do it. And straight away, if there's spoilers, I want to go into this series completely blank. Completely blind to what's going to happen. Because that's what excites me. That's I don't want any hints or anything. I just want to see what happens. You guys deserve to see season 5 now. You've waited long enough. I hope everybody's enjoyed the Christmas break. And it's back to work. I can't wait for this season at all. I think it's going to be really, really good. So last season we finished off with the Wildlings attacking Castle Black. Then we saw Stannis' army attacking the Wildlings. And now Stannis' army, I'm guessing, is... Up at Castle Black, just chilling, killing, you know. Sansa is at the Eyrie and playing the game. She's started playing the game now and she's being a bit badass. I like that. Tyrion is set free by his brother, Jaime. Varys goes along with Tyrion after Tyrion decides he's going to kill his father, Tywin. And uh, that's quite a shock on probably the kingdom, that's for sure. Because he's the most powerful man in Westeros. I would say. So yeah, lots of things happened last season and I can't go over them all. We know what happened last season. I included the bits and uh, yeah, let's just, let's watch now. Let's see where this season can take us in the first episode. There's some pretty dresses getting ruined then. We shouldn't be out here alone. Why not? If your father here... He'll never know we're gone. You don't need to be afraid of my father. Is that Cersei as a child? That looks like Cersei as a child. They said that you were terrifying. With cat's teeth and three eyes. You're not terrifying. She definitely acts like Cersei. You're boring. Tell me my future or I'll have your two boring eyes gouged out of your head. Definitely sounds like Cersei. <laughs> will the king and I have children? No. The king will have 20 children. And you will have three. That doesn't make sense. Gold will be their crowns. Seems quite accurate. <laughs> Seems very accurate. Come on, we have to go. Oh yeah, her dad's gonna be in there. Tywin's gonna be in there. All dead. A bit like Joffrey was. And here's the person that set Tyrion free. Who inevitably led to Tywin's death, essentially. Tyrion may be a monster, but at least he killed our father on purpose. You killed him by mistake, with stupidity. You're a man of action, aren't you? When it occurs to you to do something, you do it. As I Never said, mind the consequences. He inevitably kind of killed Tywin by letting Tyrion free. With the consequences. Here they are. Those stones with the eyes on are fucking freaky as shit. Like, that's creepy. That would terrify me. That's nightmare worthy. Oh, is this Tyrion in the box? Being moved to somewhere. Where is he? Don't tell me he's back at King's Landing. That looks like the gardens. He, he won't be there. Varys wouldn't do that. Varys left for his sake as well. It looks a bit rough. Apologies. <laughs> That's all that can be said. I don't think this is King's Landing Garden. Do you know what it's like to stuff your ship through one of those air holes? No. 
I only know what it's like to pick up your shit and throw it overboard. Oh, oh, what a terrible job. <laughs> the home of my colleague. Oh. A merchant. Okay, He that's and fair I enough. met many years ago through mutual friends, and thus began the chain of mistakes that has led us both here. That can't be a good idea Things to drink wine. worse, not better. Like, Westeros needs to be saved from itself. How long has, has any drunk for? Are you a lord if you kill your father? Probably not. I don't imagine me. Yeah, I don't think it'd be a good idea to... Yeah. But it continues. <laughs> Raise your hand if you've ever puked and then carried on drinking. I'm sure we've all been there. If you're of age, of course. Oh, shit. Sons of the Harpy. Yes. What the fuck is that? They left it on the body. Damn, he's going hard on this kid. Don't let them send us away. I told you. Wherever you go, I go too. You can't leave, they'll execute you. That's a good point. Good, good. Pivot. Don't forget to pivot. Shield up. He is learning. The king wants a word. Oh, fuck yeah. Stupid bitch. Oh, I don't like her whatsoever. Some of the Night's Watch feel you have too much affection for the wildlings. They were born on the wrong side of the wall. Doesn't make them monsters. The men of the Night's Watch are sworn to play no part. Talking about the damn Night's Watch. I'm talking about the wildlings. That's not going to work, though. I don't think Mance Raider would would bend the knee to um, a, a king. Good grace. Convince him to bend the knee. Good grace. Or he burns. Oh shit. How much time do I have? Nightfall. Oh Sun shit. Comes fast this time of year. Hurry, Jon Snow. Oh, he doesn't have much time. Shield up. Meanwhile, attack, my lord. While attack. Ollie is learning to Don't fight. My sons have swords in their hands for the time they can walk. This, this one, one is doing a terrible a job. Great warrior. Great warrior. Oh dear. He swings a sword like a girl with palsy. <laughs> He'll be safe here. As for his skills, I make no promises. <laughs> He's always going to be shit. <laughs> Your father was a, a force to be reckoned with. He truly was. I don't think she wants to hear your quibble. To claim to have known him as such, but what a, what a force to be reckoned with. Thank you so much for your kind words. <laughs> now shut the fuck up. <laughs> what could you possibly have done to warrant my forgiveness? I led you into the darkness. I doubt you've ever led anyone anywhere. I tempted you into our unnatural relations. And of course, there was the king. His boar hunt. Is one. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm a different person now. I found peace in the light of the Seven. You can too. They watch over all of us, ready to dole out mercy or justice. If she doesn't marry me, she doesn't go to Highgarden, which means she stays in King's Landing. Which means you're trapped here with Cersei Lannister as your mother by law. Perhaps. <laughs> Perhaps. Perhaps. Ooh, what she got planned? What has she? What she got planned? He's still drinking away. Then. 
doesn't care that much clearly. I believe men of talent have a part to play in the war to come. I'm the war to, to come. The soldier. A ruler loved by millions with a powerful army and the right family name. Good luck finding him. Who said anything about him? Ooh. You have a choice, my friend. Is he on about you Daenerys? You can stay here at Illyrio's palace and drink yourself to death. Or you can ride with me to Marine, meet Daenerys Targaryen, yes. and decide if the world is worth fighting for. Can I drink myself to death on the road to Marine? Yes! Team up with Daenerys Targaryen, now that would be badass. Somebody worth fighting for. Looks like your friends haven't been behaving themselves.